Hey everybody, this is Adam Fawn coming to you again from Paducah, Kentucky with another three-minute book review. And on this time's book review, we have a history book for you, one that was published in 2000 or 2001, I believe, by James Bradley. The name of the book is Flags of Our Fathers. Very well-known book. You may have come across this from time to time. It was a bestseller, as the thing up here says. But I wanted to point this book out to you for a couple of reasons. One is I just loved it. I, I think Bradley does a great job of weaving together the uh, the personal side of this. If you don't know the, the story behind this book, of course, it's about the flag raising at Iwo Jima. But Bradley, uh, his dad, his father, was one of the men who was there. And so he, he tells, of course, the story of his dad, but he also tells the personal stories of those men who were identified, the difficulty of identifying them, uh, and how there's a lot, there was a lot of controversy about that. And, of course, he weaves all that together with what they actually went through uh, in the Pacific, especially, of course, on the island of Iwo Jima. That part is very difficult to get through, quite frankly, uh, because you're dealing with one of the most horrific battles fought in World War II, especially, of course, the Pacific Theater. But he does a great job of interweaving the personal, in other words, the people's lives, with the picture, that is, the flag-raising picture, the setting of that and the history of that, and then, of course, the battle itself. But the other reason I want to point this book out to you right now on a three-minute book review is because you may have seen a news story the last, oh, couple of weeks that they now believe that one of the people, in fact, they're mentioning this book, has been misidentified for all of these years, or at least the last number of years. Because if you know the picture, the statue or the picture, you know that most of them are, you know, all of them are looking the other way. Some are just like a hand here or there. But they have all this research. They know who they are. But one of them has been misidentified. So I, I kind of find that a fascinating kind of backstory or extra story behind this book. You know, you know, now in 2019, all these years after this book was written, that we're reading about somebody who may not have been in the picture at all. But it, be that as, as it may, this is a book that will really make you uh, grateful for the sacrifice that so many made in the Pacific Theater as well as just World War II in general. It'll make you have appreciation for that photograph itself. Uh, some very interesting details about that. I don't want to give away on the review, but uh, you, you'll find them very fascinating about those who were there on that day and what actually happened. And then the personal lives, uh, what they did leading up to the Second World War, of course, what they did during the war, and then some after story. What, what happened to these men who were in this picture uh, all these uh, after the war for several, several years? Wonderful book. Of course, you can find it on Amazon. If you're watching this on Facebook, you can click on the description above. If you're watching on YouTube, you can click on the description below, and there'll be a link to Amazon because the two purposes of the three-minute book review, one is to encourage you with good books. The other, of course, is to, uh, well, you help send our kids to college. A small uh, kickback from Amazon, if you click on the link Facebook above, YouTube below, and find uh, a link to fa uh, flags, excuse me, of our fathers by James Bradley. Wonderful book for uh, history lovers, World War II lovers, uh, really even photography lovers because of the fame of this picture. I think you'll find a great deal about this book, encouraging and helpful, a great history book. I think you'll greatly enjoy it. Thanks for watching this episode of the 3-Minute Book Review, and we hope you'll watch us again very, very soon. If you're on YouTube, make sure you subscribe to the channel. We'd appreciate that greatly, and join us again very soon for another 3-Minute Book Review.